been good this year. Good timely pass. That one, that, that was Miles is going to have to shoot. Bingo! How about that one, partner? What a shot by Corey Joseph. How about that one? Get it. Corey Joseph. The six. And there's the result. Joseph gets the goal. Yogi picks it for Joseph. Quick move baseline. Scores at a foul. That's the old Steve Smith okie doke right there. A little look away. That the Pacers are wearing tonight. Corey Joseph inside. Jefferson is standing there and delivers. Statement. Stevenson went nowhere. Points was set the screen. Step back. Tough shot. Good D and a better shot by Corey Joseph. As you got to assume they won't continue to make those, so you got to take advantage of keep those going. Joseph, free he's throw line. It. He's feeling it. I'm telling you. You can tell he was feeling it. With 23 seconds left, third quarter. Joseph, 6-6, into the paint and scores. An artful drive by the 26-year-old Corey Joseph. A 17-point lead. Okay. Goes right around court. And a three from Joseph is good. Victor Oladipo out there handling and controlling Aaron Gordon. Now here's Joseph. They leave him open, and he goes inside Sabone as he pounds it. So let's go back. Carmelo Anthony is available. And before the Pacers acquired Wesley Matthews. Right there. Joseph, nice pass into Young. Good job of keeping the ball moving. In the G League with Westchester. Played at Wisconsin. He's available to play tonight. Corey Joseph drains the baseline jump shot. 22 seconds to go, the lead up to nine. No theatrics and heroics tonight. Joseph with the three makes it a seven point game. Back in front of Victor Oladipo. Joseph dumps it back for Lee. Some nice looking yeah. stroke out of the rook. Yes, did he communicate well enough to let his intentions be known? No, he did not. But it was it done maliciously? No, it was not. Is to get a shot. He is the fourth trailblazer with at least two fouls. Miles Leonard has three, and somehow Corey Joseph off one leg got there. Kylo Quinn has come in as Sabonis had to go to the bench with four fouls. As Corey Joseph adds two more. 13 tonight for Kojo, one shy of his season high. Always continue from out there. And they just continue to get worse. They're two for 24. Spinning Joseph and scoring. That he can probably take advantage of when you're playing against McDermott. Joseph on the baseline. Monroe. Here's Joseph now. Cut off by Ananobi. Now change of direction. Help comes. Nice move by Corey Joe. Six prior to the win against the Bulls on Saturday night. I think we'll agree that Ojo was nowhere in the neighborhood. There's oh. Ojo there. <laughs> That's a Kojo there. Just do a great job counter punching. They are relentless. Here's Joseph behind the back, pulled back, and he drills it. They say they do it together, pretty much. Corey Joseph, baseline J, and good. Good with those. Joseph, a corner three for Corey Joseph. Turner, shot clock at five. Joseph using the screen. Fend off and floater. Good teams get shots off, don't they, with three or four seconds on the shot clock? So the Clippers going to work for the fourth quarter underway. A two-point lead. Inside the Harold. It's blocked away brilliantly from behind by little Corey Joseph. Joseph. Boy, a tough finish with under a second to play. That's the end of the first quarter. Golden State, despite winning on Tuesday night, was out rebounded by Oklahoma City. 58 to 40, and a chance for a three point play. Yeah, that's a good dump, but that's a foul on Bell. Bounce Joseph, clock at 12. Story Joseph. Fall away, fills it up after a little shake. Working against Reggie Jackson. 60 points or so in the first half of that game, but it took a just another, another worldly effort by DeMar DeRozan for them to win that game. Celtics has got a back-to-back. -back. They're playing my, Miami tomorrow, so keeping the minutes down is important. Joseph hits a fall away on the baseline. Four re 
rebounds and an assist already. In fact, he is Indiana's leading scorer. Collison has come back in and fires and hits a three. He started his career in New Orleans back in 09. And Donovan Mitchell with his second hoop of the quarter. Has to hurry, got it, roll it in. Corey Joseph just hit the two free ones and the Jazz down 10 after 12 minutes. Second, Selden has it. Selden goes to the basket, lost it, picked up Bogdanovich. And J.B. Bickerstaff is livid and on the floor. They're feeding off that right now. Young for three. And the Magic not making it difficult at all. In Orlando, shot clock down to four. Back cut, Joseph up and under. How about the pass from Collison? The movement by Joseph to get the layup as a shot clock. Knowing you leave again tomorrow for three? Well, yes. It, it, I, I've said that before, but it's it's to me, and I said this at halftime, Boulder, it's about energy. Nice find. Really good cut by Bogdanovich, and you're right, it was. Five seconds to play. Joseph, he'll get a look. Got to the basket and scores. Does a good job. Now Joseph takes it all the way. Finds a bonus for the basket and a foul. Well, Joseph got popped to John Goble. And, and John Goble, the thing that I like about our, the, the, pace, the, the game of the NBA today, as a basket there by Troy Joseph. Understand, there's a lot of ways you got to play. Oladipo with the steal. Stepped in front of the Isaiah Thomas pass. What a solid pass there. What a solid pass by Joseph. That's a timeout. Thompson cut off by Rivers. And now Joseph. With a good look on the inside to get Booker and easy. Okay, what you see out here, the Chris, is different. This is a much more defense, an active defense by Boston. Corey Joseph, Joseph knocks that down. You need to break that ice somewhere. Now to two now. Joseph surrounded. Sabonis got it off just in time and banked it home. Less than a minute to play. Third quarter. Joseph, high arcing jumper. Corey Joseph. Corey under pressure. Good flash by Lyle. Corey Joseph breaks by into the corner. Bogdanovich, why you left him, I don't know. Just did not go down. And back on D, Joseph gets it over to Oladipo. Boy, he's deadly from the outside. Well, and because of that, they got a lot of guys that are putting up numbers as well. Jim, they had nine players reach double-figure scoring as Corey Joseph hits the long two. With the finish, 12 points now for Pirtle. Collison finds Corey Joe, sidestep Corey Joe, the three from Pickering. They go high low. Yeah, but he's, he's got to come back to Valanciunas. And Young lays it in. The Pacers have their first lead. And they are sharp. Doug McDermott feeds Joseph, moves in, and floats it home. Nice shot there by Joseph. Good. Too much to cover for TJ McConnell. Sixers with the turnover. Joseph hitting Young who was fouled by Amir Johnson as well. That's such a high level. Shot clock at two. Young running out of time. Joseph in the corner. Joe Young made a good decision. The Spectrum Center in Charlotte feels good now, getting healthy, and that's where he wants to be for the start of next season. Yeah, I mean, I, I think he would because he was having such a good year. Joseph kind of tripped up. He still got inside and scored. What a play. Atlanta, he's back where he started his career. He played his first two seasons here in New York. Yeah, that was a tough pass. Now McDermott. And Joseph. Corey Joseph. Boy, he's a good quality backup point guard. Brooklyn led by 12 in the first quarter, by 19 in the second. Joseph, a little teardrop off the glass. The problem they got to do, they're not able to get it to Quinto Quin time. Tough shot there by Corey Joseph. Oh, I, know, I thought more than reached up. 
Nice swing. That's all right. That's a good swing. That's all you want to do is get a good shot. The fact that he swung it. <laughs> that hurts. <laughs> well, uh, if she's been a, and, and that's Poitras yeah. chipping it in. She's been a fan, so she, she, there's no question. Again, they're not shy. They shoot 37 of those per night. And Lopez shoots about seven of them as Corey Joseph hits a jumper, and Milwaukee needs a timeout. <laughs> Milwaukee at 6-4 against Leaf, who's 6-10. That's Holiday, one of the three Holiday brothers in the NBA. Joseph pulls up the two. It's a tough shot. That sure was. 44-41. Nine minute mark for the Nets. Everything is going to be shooting. Let's see if they take advantage of it. Joseph gives it up. Oh. Some bonus. Big finish. Well, Oladipo is definitely oh, struggling. Oh, a steal by Corey Joseph. Goes up on February and scores. And the Pacers have it with seven seconds to play. Joseph, teardrop, got it. Well, heck of a job going from one end to the other. And the shot clock was ready to expire, but I mean, the game clock. Joseph, three pointer for Corey Joseph. Corey Joseph, rocking herder, drives on it. Left hand rolls it in. First basket. Sabonis. And he beat Nance with a nice spin move. What it is that Lance needs, and he understands that, and I think the trust becomes the issue. Turner for a second three. Final five seconds. Joseph at three. Steph right with him. The little leaner, and he got it. Good play by Corey Joseph to beat the buzzer. Now Oladipo finds Joseph. Gets it right back from Evans on a wide open corner three. Wow, that's an unselfish play there from Tyreek Evans. He just hit a three. Just a free throw here in the first half. Oh, great find. Yes! You can see how athletic McDermott is. What a great find there. This and you get it down the court. Corey Joseph from half court. That, it in. that counts. That counts. The Pacers needed it, and so did Corey Joseph. He had missed his first three shots, had just missed the three, and banks it in.